first of all, his sets, it's just a, a joy. He, he loves cinema so much, as you know, and loves talking about it, you know, loves, the, there's a great verve and energy on the set. It's unlike like any others. And then working together was just, it was just a real automatic for us. Um, um, I, I can't, I can't describe it more than that. It was just really easy and a good laugh. And we, mm. you know, we, we, we came on the scene around the same time. We have a lot of the same references and, you know, we all know the same people and, and he's just really giving and, and generous. You see that in the film. The first thing Quentin does besides have you read the script is he gave us this immense backstory and biography of not only our individual characters, but our relationship together, our history so detailed. together. As two sort of outsiders in the industry, industry that are sort of making their way, you know, trying day by day to be successful. So having grown up in this town, getting all that reference and being able to work with Brad, I think the first day there was just this automatic understanding of who these types of men were and how they relied on one another implicitly to survive and navigate through this industry. It's a love letter to the, this community that we, that we love and, and have hated at times and adore and LA, which we love and, and you know, cinema and the people, the greats, cinema and television. And those, even those unsung, you know, people who came before us, which is much, you know, is like Rick Dalton's character. What's unique about this movie is it's, it's, it's a slice of life. It's a day in the life of all of these people, the th people that are within and without, and, and certainly the, the undercurrent of the Manson girls and how that really changed uh, America and culture forever. I mean, that 1969 was not, not just a seminal year as far as uh, changing cinematic history, but the world. I mean, so many radical movements and things were happening during that time period. He gives us a, like this sort of time warp, but also mixed with that Tarantino sort of fairy tale aspect of it too. It's this nostalgic look back at a time and what could have been through the eyes of guys that, you know, are on the daily grind just trying to make ends meet. And, you know, our characters are, are, are rely on each other for